NFL legends put anthem protesters to shame with special tribute to Christ. In light of the ongoing anthem protesters by entitled football millionaires, a group of former NFL legends showed the current crop what true greatness is all about. This past summer, 18 NFL Hall of Famers were baptized in the Jordan River in Israel, Sports Spectrum reported. In Matthew 3, the scriptures record that Jesus was baptized in the Jordan by John the Baptist. The group of players who were baptized included Jim Brown, Joe Montana, Roger Staubach, Joe Green, Chris Carter, Andre Reid, John Stallworth, Eric Dickerson, Marshall Falk, Dave Casper, Jerome Bettis, Ron Yeri, Aeneas Williams, Lem Barney, Willie Lanier, Mike Singletary, Andre Tippett, and Bruce Smith, according to Sports Spectrum. Former Arizona Cardinals player Aeneas Williams, who is a pastor at the Spirit Church in St. Louis, Missouri, was there to help perform the baptisms for the players. This is the sort of stuff that the media should be covering, but of course they won't because it would show something other than people kneeling on the ground to take part in a pointless protest. Baptism is an outward sign of what has already happened on the inside of us, Williams explained. Getting in the water, literally, your sins have been washed away and when you come up, it is symbolically a new person. The old person has been buried. We rejoice in the Lord, he stated. You can watch a video about the baptism here. This action also highlights the generation gap between football players. The old guard are concerned with their love for God, while the newer generation is more concerned about how many people will like a picture of them kneeling. The newer generation really has its priorities screwed up. In a few years, once their bodies are completely shattered from playing football, they will be completely forgotten by the American public and will having nothing to show for their protests. However, the old guard have made their peace with God, and have clearly accepted something more important than a cool hashtag and a 30-second sound bite. This is the sort of stuff we should be promoting. Share this on Facebook and Twitter and let us know your reaction to these baptisms. What do you think about what these Hall of Famers did? Scroll down to comment below and below.